girl Raven, aka your favorite, also known as your favorite Want TV producer. And that's right, we are back with our eighth episode of Want TV Quarantine Edition. Now, we do have a little surprise for you guys, but we're gonna need your help. First, we're gonna show a little something to help lift spirits and show how our Franklin high school teachers do their savage dance. So let's check it out, cause I know I wanna see it. So let's roll it. Last Friday, the teachers got together and well, we were up to something. Our students inspire us as well. I, I'm a savage. Classy, bougie, ratchet. Sassy, moody, nasty. Hacking, stupid, what was happening? What was happening? I'm a savage. Classy, bougie, ratchet. Sassy, moody, nasty. Hacking, stupid, what was happening? What was happening? I'm a savage. Classy, bougie, ratchet. Sassy, moody, nasty. Hacking, stupid, what was happening? I'm a savage. Classy, bougie, oh. Hey guys, so I hope you guys really enjoyed that because I know I sure did. It's really great to see teachers and students every week on One TV showing us what they've been doing on their quarantine and how it's been. We put a lot of hard work in every episode each week, so it's enjoyable and entertaining for you guys. But don't go away, we'll be right back. Miss Francis, one of our very own cheerleading coaches, is gonna teach us how to make a very healthy but delicious smoothie so let's check it out hi guys i'm miss francis i teach concepts of fitness and health and phys ed today i'm going to teach you how to make a healthy and delicious green smoothie welcome to my kitchen here are just a few shopping tips so that our ingredients stay super fresh and are easy on the wallet for your fruit buy the bananas fresh and use them until they're at their peak ripeness then cut them up and freeze them for other fruits like mangoes and pineapples and berries buy them in bulk because they last a while frozen now for your greens, which today we will be using kale and spinach. I buy them in bulk and then put them together in a big Ziploc bag and freeze them. Just remember to put the date on the bag because they do eventually go bad. All right, why are we using all this stuff and what's so good about it? First, we have almond milk. I use Trader Joe's unsweetened almond milk, but use any dairy product that you want or even water. We have bananas. Bananas make the smoothie extra creamy and delicious. I use half a frozen banana and I cut it up to make it easier to blend. Then we have kale and spinach. Don't be afraid to throw a big handful in there. If you follow the rest of the ingredients exactly, you won't taste it at all. Kale has a ton of nutrients. It's super high in vitamin K and C. Spinach has a ton of iron and one of the healthiest and low calorie foods that you can eat. Next we have our avocado, full of healthy fats and omega-3s. You can either use them fresh or frozen. I had a fresh one, so I used it. Then we have a couple blueberries. Strawberry snuck in there, but that's okay. Full of antioxidants. Then back here, you can see we have our mangoes and our pineapples. Pineapples are super delicious. They help reduce inflammation and mangoes are really good for your skin full of vitamin C. Up here we have our agave sweetener, really low calorie and low in sugar. You only need a little bit or you can use honey. And then we have our flaxseed. Flaxseed helps you feel full. It's full of protein and fiber and it'll make you feel nice and full after your morning smoothie. Once your smoothie is done blending, so you see that there's no uh, chunks of fruit or anything still left in there, remember we use no ice, but again, your avocado, your banana is gonna make everything super creamy and all of the frozen fruit is be tastes better than the ice anyway. So you're gonna get a pretty mason jar, whatever kind of cup that you wanna use. You're gonna fill it up. And again, it's so delicious and it's gonna make a lot so that you can drink it throughout your morning. Takes me like an hour to Drink mine. I like to put a straw in there and you're good. That's your green smoothie. Good luck. All right, so here's an update. I cleaned up, it was super easy. All of my fresh fruit just went back into the freezer. Clean up is a breeze. Uh, the smoothie tastes delicious. You don't even taste the spinach and the, t and the kale, but you are still getting all of those uh, really important nutrients for your day. Uh, but the taste is masked by the bananas and the pineapples and the mangoes. So I hope you enjoy it. I miss you all. And I hope you make my smoothie. <sighs> okay, wasn't that segment really refreshing? I had to make myself a smoothie right after watching that one. And finally, the moment you all been waiting for. Can I get a drum roll, please? 
Want TV's next top host. Unfortunately, because of COVID-19, we cannot have our auditions in the studio, which is really upsetting. But we do have a fun little twist for you guys so you can check out all our auditions and all our next top hosts right here. So let's check it out. <gasps> oh, hey, I didn't see you there. What is up, you guys? What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Alexis. It's your girl, Gabrielle. It's your girl, Jahani. It's your boy, Akshay, a.k.a. Shay. Jason Derulo. A.k.a. Makayla Baby. A.k.a. Miss Announcements. A.k.a. Mia Bia. A.k.a. Not. It's your girl, Daniela. And welcome back to another episode of Juan TV. Brand new episode of Juan TV. Juan TV. During this time of quarantine, I hope you guys are all staying safe. You know, washing your hands. You're staying hydrated. Exercising. Being proactive. And getting some serious sun, you guys. But also being thoughtful of others in their space. And caught up on all your favorite Netflix shows. Doing your homework. Get that one, honey. And don't forget to stay connected to your family and friends through FaceTime. Collecting pictures from the flood that wrecked our home. And even Zoom, because I know y'all be doing those family Zoom calls just like me. Thank me later. And please, 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 practice social distancing. Don't forget to social distance. So we can finally see each other face to face because we cannot be in the house summer of 2020. If you need to talk to anyone during this time, you can always contact your guidance counselors and trusted teachers. And that's all we have for you guys, Franklin. Hope to see y'all soon, because you'll definitely see more of me next year. Hope to see y'all next year. Hope to see y'all soon, because you'll definitely see more of me next year. Hope to see y'all soon. Because you'll definitely be seeing more of me. See you in the halls, Franklin. And I'll see you in the halls, Franklin. I'll see you in the halls, Franklin. See you in the halls, Franklin. Bye. <laughs> Wow, what a great group. Now the selection process is gonna be hard and a little tricky. So if you guys want, what we are doing for the very first time is allowing you guys to comment down below who you wanna see as your next one TV host. Wow, maybe I should audition myself because Beyonce who? Cause that's me. I'm kidding guys, but keep it clean, no shade and comment down below who you wanna see as your next one TV host. Now, this is the end of our eighth episode, but it doesn't mean it's the last episode. So make sure to check us out next week. Stay safe and healthy, Franklin, and make sure to wear your mask. We'll see you in quarantine, Franklin?